Hey, what is up everybody? I'm Star Lord, and today we're going to be kicking off a new series on my channel called Bloxburg Cribs. Now, what this basically is, is a game on Roblox called Bloxburg, where you can create your own houses, style them, and even invite your friends over and kind of roleplay if you want to. But, besides from that, I like mostly seeing people's houses, what they can create, all of the kind of creative stuff that they do. And uh, today's series, we're going to be kicking off with a very awesome builder named Apoc Pro. And Boy, does she create some awesome houses. The one that you're seeing right now, guys, is actually a motel, or a hotel, I guess. A very modern one, in fact, where people can come in, check in, and actually stay there overnight. And just looking at these screenshots, it looks amazing. There will be video gameplay with my actual, uh, my actual uh, face cam, guys, so don't worry about that. But just look at these screenshot, guys. They look absolutely amazing. Now, what the crazy thing is, is this hotel actually cost her 150 or 150,000 in game dollars, which is absolutely amazing. I thought it would be so much more than that, but that's pretty cheap for a hotel, it really is. Now, this only took one or two hours for it to create, and I couldn't believe that. I was like, really? Really? I couldn't even create that in like a week. It looks amazing, but she did it anyway for us to actually feast our eyes upon. So anyway, guys, don't forget to go into the description where her Twitter will be. If you want to see her other builds, go and follow her on that and uh, show her some support. But anyway, let's get into today's video, guys. Okay guys, so now it's time we actually look at the house in a first person kind of fly through. Uh, I'm very sorry that it is kind of jaggedy, but you can't really do much as it is Roblox. Uh, but anyway, here we are outside of Apoc's house. And if I just zoom in in first person, you can see as it turns to night, these kind of lovely colors are actually kind of standing out like the pink. You can already see the pink, the blue, and a little bit of the green over there kind of standing out. And you got Joshua and Impulsion over there, uh, Clarky on the, on top of the thing. Uh, but anyway, this is the front area where the guests come to actually park their cars. And uh, yeah, right here, you can see there's a couple of parking spots for everybody on this black tarmac, which is a nice touch to the house. It makes it look very nice, very posh. And uh, if we just go into this kind of like back clicked kind of hallway, we uh, will enter the front of the house. Uh, so there you go, just open up. And uh, as we go in, Apox here, she's playing some, she's playing some music right there. It's, it's, she's, she's playing that sad music. Um, okay, so anyway, here we are in the main kind of foyer, and uh, yeah, people can actually pay to come in here because it is kind of like a little hotel. It's kind of like a modern, very nice hotel. Uh, people can pay, and also, this is shared with the actual lobby itself. And uh, yeah, it looks very nice. You can see that they have this kind of like fireplace inside the actual wall, uh, which a lot of places do these days. A lot of places really love doing this, where like they have the fire behind the glass, and it just makes it look that much posher, I guess. Uh, she's got lights all across the top of the wall, and uh, over here she has a very nice looking uh, kind of lounge area for everyone to, to kind of like chill out, watch TV, and also order in some food. And uh, that is just exactly what is over here. So I just jump over. She actually has a popcorn maker with a microwave, uh, built into this kind of like block kind of thing and uh, also uh, the fridge over here with the cooker So yeah, if anyone feels like they want to like kind of cook or anything like that They can and it looks it looks amazing now Like I said the house kind of goes for this kind of like Malibu kind of style So basically what that means it's it's very white But the lights are very like they're like pink blue green and this kind of adds a nice like kind of gradient to the house and uh, the way she's placed them on this wall makes the inside of this lobby look absolutely amazing. Like you can see the pink, the green fade into the blue, fade into the yellow, and it looks brilliant. And uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to go upstairs now and check out the bathrooms, or the bedrooms even, or the hotel rooms. Uh, and we're going to start off with room one. So if we just go inside here. You'll see it still sticks to the same theme, a very brown and white kind of color scheme, which I didn't think would work that well in my mind, but it looks very good on the actual game itself. It looks brilliant. Uh, so here is kind of the typical guest room for the people staying over at the motel uh, with these kind of pink lampshades. 
and uh, also if we just go inside to the uh, bathroom you can see it looks pretty good it's kind of a standard bathroom I guess uh, but this bath has actually the uh, kind of shower built into it which is a nice little touch uh, that she decided to add so if we just go outside here gonna shut the door uh, we're gonna go into the second room and uh, again, very nice. It's got some storage shelf right here. It's got slashing sleeping in the bed. And uh, some very nice art that she's decided to throw in. It's very uh, it's very nice that she decided to add in that kind of professional art. But as you can see, pretty much all the rooms are the same. It doesn't look like we really have to pay much for like an, a premium room. They're all kind of premium in a kind of sense. Uh, but the bathroom is a little bit different here. It's kind of like squeezed together with the toilet and the, and the, and the, and the, and the actual bath and stuff like that. Uh, which is kind of weird, but still, it works. It still works. There's enough room to move about. So, let us then move on to the next room, which is the room number three. So, we open this up. This is actually my favorite room. This is the one I love because it's most spacious. And uh, again, with some of the uh, kind of art on the side, we got the lovely bed over here looking at the big, huge TV. And uh, over here, we also have a little balcony to kind of look at and uh, view the other people's houses. And it uh, looks very nice. Looks very nice indeed. And we just go into the bathroom. And again, oh god, what is going on here? What is going on here, Josh and Impulsion? Jesus. Well, anyway, yeah, looks very nice. And uh, like I said, very professionally made. Very professionally made. Looks so, so cool. Uh, and then, of course, we have this huge balcony out here which just kind of overlooks the parking lot and it kind of like a little generalized kind of area for friends to kind of talk and kind of like just enjoy themselves out on the balcony itself because I know a lot of people who play this game love to role play. Uh, so that is a very nice touch to the actual outside of it and now what we're going to do is go to the back of the hotel and we're going to start off with the pool. The pool is a pretty good size. It's not like the biggest pool but then again it is very nice and it kind of suits the whole house itself, I guess. It doesn't really need to be that big when it looks like this. So, from the outside right here, as you saw from the uh, preview pictures before I started the 3D tour, I guess, the outside is kind of like lit up by this green, pink, yellow, and blue kind of lights. They look amazing. They really do. And I'm going to add them to a couple of my builds. And I think that they're pretty much spaced apart perfectly like they just look perfect like the, the the way they fade into like the greeny uh pink and then also like the pink kind of fades into a purple and then the blue it just looks great um so a very nice place for people to kind of hang out i would say though there should be some kind of like lighting over in this corner that i'm in as it is a little tiny bit dark so yeah uh, moving on also again with some of the colors there she decided to add in these circle lights just by the gym which look amazing so I really enjoyed that she added those in I thought they were a nice touch uh, and also like I said this is the gym itself uh, with the punching bags it's pretty much got everything that you can use in here it's got the running machine the weightlifting bench and also a big huge speakers or like th four huge speakers actually for people to blast music and actually work out to which is pretty pretty nice and uh, yeah it is kind of backlit with a purple uh, a kind of pinky purple kind of thing there it looks perfect it looks great uh, so we kind of go out here again walking down this little kind of like hallway it looks so gradient like look at that look at the colors that looks amazing it looks so beautiful i don't really know where these lights are coming from but it was kind of nice that she added those in rather than it just being blank it just kind of makes it look that more like a holiday kind of house, a holiday kind of a hotel. I don't know. I like the way she added that in. So very nice anyway. We've pretty much got to the end of the actual thing itself. Like if we just take one more look at the outside of the house, you can see here's the front of it with a lot of pinky colors like popping out. You can also see the blues. And then as we get around here, you can still see the wings popping through the door. But yeah, as we get around here, you can actually see that there is like so much about this house. It just looks crazy good. It looks crazy good. It's amazing. Uh, but anyway, guys, that has pretty much been it for today's house tour, which does kick off the first episode of the series, which I am going to be doing. If you do have any like kind of uh, houses that you want me to showcase in these videos, then please remember to tweet at me. Uh, my Twitter will be in the description or probably on screen right now. So just kind of follow that on. Show me some kind of uh, screenshots from the outside of your house and also the inside. And if I like it or not, it will most likely feature in the next video or a couple of videos from now uh, but anyway 
amazing house today and uh, yeah if you did enjoy this video guys don't forget to leave a like and also subscribe if you want to see more videos like this uh, but anyway have an awesome day and until next time i've been star lord oh see ya